and Wreck TV. I could put a call in Merkew in third person. Yeah. Put two in your turban, jump in the blue suburban. Yeah. You know, it's, it's certain people in the industry, they ain't never switch up on me. And you know, I see who it is. I see who's real and who's not. Um, so anyway, I was gonna go on Ellen and I was gonna make a couple announcements on Ellen. One of the announcements that I was gonna make on Ellen was that I'm doing my um, scholarship, scholarship slash tuition slash student loans thing again via Twitter. I'm gonna do it when we get off of this, immediately following this live. I'm gonna go on Twitter and give a give away about twenty five to fifty thousand dollars. So you guys have your um have your tweets ready. Cause if I fave your tweet, gonna have my assistant hit you and get your information. The last time we did it, it was really, really dope, and um, I was really proud of it. And Ellen, Ellen is the first celebrity who donated to it. The charity is called um, Student of the Game. That's my own personal charity. And um, so that's what I'm gonna do immediately following this live. How many people are we at? 37K. Okay. You guys know me so well. Let's start by saying that. You guys know that if my album was coming out on June 15th, a bitch would be already having that countdown and all of that. Um, the label wants me, the label wanted me to put out my album since, you know, 10,000 years ago, of course. I love my label, but I'm, I'm happy that I've always been blessed to have the freedom um, and the creativity to do what I want, how I want it, when I want. My own personal charities. I love my label, but I'm I'm happy that I've always been blessed to have the freedom um, and the creativity to do what I want, how I want it, when I want. Um, so, yes, the label wants me to drop my album on June fifteenth. They think you know we're ready to go. I miss the times where we used to like, where I used to go on Ustream and we used to, we would like wild out and like just have fun and it wouldn't become like a news story or something. I've, you know, it's hard to have that connection now because everything is just, you know, um, you know, just always twisted into something negative. And so I'm trying, you know, I've been trying to figure out how can I maintain the personal relationship that I've always had with my fans without it being something for the media to twist and turn and, you know. But it's the price you pay. Um, I was feeling horrible and I didn't feel 100% yesterday. So I was like, you know what, let me just take one more day to rest. So that's what I did. Um, the new now, first I wanna say, on June 15th, you guys will be extremely happy. I have three surprises happening between June 11th and June 15th. One of those surprises is the album cover. I can't wait to share that with you. Uh, the other surprise is some is, is some stuff that I just rather surprise you with uh, on that date. Just know that you guys are gonna get your life from it. Um, the tour is not being pushed back. The tour is still happening um, beginning at the end of September. We are still going to be rehearsing to give you guys an epic tour. And I miss y'all. I miss being on stage and feeling the vibrations. I, like there's, I'll never, I'll never get used to that. Like I'll never get over it. How all around the world, you guys give me the same thing. It, it, it motivates me, you know, um, and it always feels new. Um, so on, so you guys are still gonna be happy on June 15th. Three surprises 
three surprises on June 15th that are going to give you your whole complete life. But the album itself, I think I want to put out on August 10th. I want to put out my second single, which I'm really, really excited about. And I want to now start an official countdown. I also want to do like some things where I invite some of my actual fans to the studio um, and listen to the album and listen to the songs and, you know, hear the second single and, you know, all that stuff. Just make it really exciting how we did with Pink Friday and how we did with everything else following Pink Friday. Um, trust me, it's, it's, the, it's the better choice. So it's August 10th! And I'm so excited. Like, the this album is just so fucking incredible. And it's because I can't give y'all half-ass. I can't give y'all half-ass shit. I just refuse to. I refuse to. A label can't understand that. A label can't understand my level of perfection or me being a perfectionist. It's just who I am. Um, you know? And, uh... There are some dope uh, features on the album that I wanna, that you know I wanna give a, I wanna give more time to be able to mix those records and and make them even doper and you know and and also some other stuff happened with some beats and um, anyway the moral of the story is the album is coming out August tenth Queen um, but June fifteenth I'm gonna make it worth your while. Um, I have, I just can't wait. I just, I wish I could tell y'all everything, but then, you know, it defeats the purpose and my label doesn't, my label doesn't want me to tell you guys everything yet. We got incredible merch that I can't wait to show you. And most importantly, the album cover. The album cover is coming. Um, I'll put that out, um, you know, on June, um, 11th. It's, the album cover was shot by Merton Marcus. So I'm really excited about that. Um, I'm trying to think if there's anything else I wanted to say to you guys um, other than I love you and I thank you for your unconditional love and support. I thank you guys for always holding me down. I thank you guys for always, you know, defending me and going super hard for me. Um, this is my best album. Everyone that's heard this album has said it's my best album. But there are a few things that I want to get in order. Um... You guys will have, you. I'll, I'll also be doing a pre-order. I'll also be po putting up the pre-order in June. So June is going to be a great month for us. Um, but, you know, there's some performances that I want to do, you know, some award shows and stuff that I want to do before the album comes out. So I'm, I'm signing out. I'll meet you guys back on Twitter because um, I want to do the, the tuition scholarship giveaway. Um, but August 10th. Now, you guys... This is the official date now, so I want you guys to set up the countdown. Every day, we'll be doing a countdown. I don't know how many days it is from now to August 10th, but we'll be doing the official countdown now, between now and August 10th. You're going to get your life. Um, we'll be rehearsing for the tour. I might fly some lucky fans out to witness the um, tour rehearsals. I have a lot of dope things planned, and just trust me, I know what's best. I know what's best for the execution of this project. And I, I've never been, you know, I, I've never been the type of artist that, that a label can, you know, tell me what to do with my music and with my fans. And I think part of the reason that people um, hate is because they can't break, you know, what I have with my fans. They can't stop this unbreakable bond that we've had because it's a genuine bond. We've had this before Instagram came along. We've, I've named my fans before. It was a trend to name your fans. Um, you know, so, you know, they don't understand that when I'm, re when I'm saying things to you guys, that I follow you guys. They don't understand that I, that I know you guys by name, that I know you guys by face. This is not a fake celebrity fan relationship. This is really my babies, my fans, my, my world. Um, and, and I don't care about anything else. All I care about is the relationship that I have with, with my fans. It's never going to change. You guys can keep on trying. They've tried so hard to paint me out to be, this, to be the bad guy, but it's never worked. Nevertheless, I've never been better. Creatively, I've never been sharper. Um, I am going to also release the documentary 
um, a little bit before the album, you will see me creating the songs. You'll see it. You'll see me create Chun Li. I made up Chun Li in like 30 seconds, and you'll see it. You'll really see it being done. And I know you guys always want to see that type of stuff happening in real time. And so, you know, you guys will have it. I want to thank, I want to even thank all the celebrity um, peop, uh, the celebrities who've supported me. Um, all the radio stations will be getting a gold plaque next week for Chun Li. Um, Chun Li is number eight on Urban Radio, uh, 12 on Rhythmic Radio. So, you know, thank you to SNL. I loved the performance. Thank you to my team. I love my team. Team has never been stronger. I'm not going to hold you guys up too much. Um, but, you know, I hope I hope you know June is still going to be a very exciting, the, the most exciting month for us in, um, in the last three years. So, you can ask me questions on Twitter and I'll, um, I'll um, narrow it down. Um, also, the, the song with YG, 2 Chains, and Big Sean drops tonight at midnight. And bitch, I love that motherfucking song. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Y'all gonna love my verse. Everybody came off on that song. Every verse is hard. Shout out to YG for having me. You know, all three of them I fuck with hard body, you know. Or my real niggas, it's, you know, it's, it's certain people in the industry. They ain't never switch up on me. And, you know, I see who it is. I see who's real and who's not. Um, but I do have to thank, you know, radio for supporting Chun-Li. Um, I appreciate it very, very much. Um, so August 10th, um, I love you guys very much. I'm about to do the scholarship stuff on Twitter now, okay? Mm. Everybody's a target, I don't know who to aim at. I can get you lined up, get your little chain snap. I'm getting on your whole self since you want to claim that. Click check. Yeah, nigga, take that. Straight from Coney Island, must be something in the waters. Niggas getting charges for murders and manslaughters. Niggas on the watch for them cops and them camcorders and them grimy OGs be fucking they man's daughters. Peace, world. To promote your music or promote your business by placing an ad on MREC TV, contact MREC TV promo. M R E C K T V promo at gmail.com. Peace. Switch things to the opposite way. It's the map that the strippers and the groupies pay. Yeah, bands make her dance. You can't juice this J. We about to terrorize the rap game. Fuck it right and give it back pain. Uh -huh. Ever since a kid, it stayed focused, barely hung out. Uh -huh. Pops went to jail, mom, dukes got sprung out. Like Jordan with the tongue out, determined to win. And got the best product out, and you killing the strip. I taught the money gymnastics, I'm making it flip. Hit the block hard, yes, early morning on a wake up. Baby Crocker cook skills, help me get my cake up. Cause she's coming left and right, it feels like the first. Okay. The money is a gift, but the bills is a curse. I'm a overachiever, not a superstition believer. I'm good everywhere, like credit from a visa The rotten apple, you could get shot in your Adam's apple Giving God praise, leaving out the tabernacle Let me squeeze trigger 45 I feel like Kevin cost them bodyguard Holding down with me, that paperwork got his name on it They snitch niggas in every... Oh yeah, subscribe to MREC TV, YouTube.com Slash MREC TV I'm gone M Rec TV. It's got a music. It's got a music.